morning, family of FAST. Matt Mossman, the Chief Endurance Officer over at Endurlead. Have you ever wondered why, as an endurance athlete, why you get slower as you age? That is the million dollar question we are gonna answer today. So as you get to be 40 and 50, you might notice yourself slowing down a little bit more and maybe not being able to recover. And you're wondering, what the heck is going on? Well, I'm gonna tell you the perfectly good reasons why this is happening and what you can do about it. So let's just get right into it. Basically, there's two reasons why you get slower as you age. The first is loss of muscle strength from two different things. One, it occurs from changes in the nervous system. And then two, and the major cause of this loss of muscle strength is something called sarcopenia, which is the basically the loss of muscle mass as you age. There's not a darn thing you can do to prevent it 100%, but there are some things you can do to kind of slow it down, which we'll get into later. So the sarcopenia is caused by two different things. It's caused by the loss of muscle fibers and then also a decrease in the muscle fiber size. But the majority of that loss from the sarcopenia comes from the actual loss of muscle fibers. And this happens for, uh, for various reasons. It can be from inflammation, damage from free radicals, and especially decrease in anabolic hormones like uh, testosterone. Now, what you can expect for loss of muscle mass is after the age of about 50, you lose about 1% to 2% of muscle mass per year. So you can see between the ages of 50 and 80, you can lose a heck of a lot of muscle mass unless you do some things that can slow that down again, which we'll talk about here in a little bit. So that's the first reason why you get slower as an endurance athlete as you age is based from that loss of muscle strength attributed to the sarcopenia. Now, the second reason why you get slower as an endurance athlete as you age, man, isn't it frustrating, is basically due to a decrease in VO2 max. And this is caused by a decrease in cardiac output, which is caused by a decrease in maximal heart rate and maximal stroke volume, which is also caused by a decrease in capillary density and mitochondrial density as well. So basically just how well you are able to saturate oxygen levels through the tissue is all decreased because of all these factors. So that's the second cause of why you get slower as you age. Now that we know that, what the heck can you do as an older endurance athlete to kind of slow down some of these decreases in endurance performance as you age? Well, for the loss of muscle strength, and you guys probably already know this, the number one thing you want to do like right now, like as of yesterday, is start to strength train at least two to three days a week to kind of help keep those muscle mass and muscle fiber levels up so they're not just basically getting annihilated by sarcopenia um, when you hit the age of 40 or 50. Now, the second thing you can do as it relates to VO2 max is, you know, be smart about your training. That involves, you know, using training principles, like say if you're a runner, you're doing, you know, long, slow distance, you're doing intervals, uh, lactate threshold sessions to keep your VO2 max up. But most importantly, as you age, you want to be smart about your recovery days so you don't end up with an overuse injury and then your VO2 max really plummets really quickly. And we want to avoid that at all costs. So those are kind of the three ways you can kind of slow down those decrements in performance as you age. Now, there's nothing you can do to completely stop it. Again, this is just kind of slow down uh, the decreases in performance as you age. So that is all I have today on how you can stop from getting slower, or at least somewhat slower, as you age. If you want other videos or information like this, head on over to the Endure Elite blog at www.endureelite.com. Head over to our Family of Fast Facebook group or head on to one of our social channels on Facebook, Instagram, all that other fun stuff. And until next time, Family of Fast, stay fueled, stay focused, and stay fast.